Hello guys, uh, this is Tashi. Today I would like to share with you how I create a, a simple announcement video to be used on TikTok. But for this tutorial, I'll be posting it on to YouTube because TikTok video is uh, much uh, smaller, 9.16, which is uh, I think you won't be able to to actually see uh, what I'm doing. So for this tutorial purpose, uh, I'll want to create a white video. So this is the Mora video editor, and over here at the downloaded some files to be used for this project I'll simply drag this onto Filmora video editor over here you can see I have uh, yeah, this jigsaw puzzle uh, video uh, which I want to use for uh, background and I think it's uh, good for background just that uh, yeah, the beginning of the video is not that good because it's a uh, black screen and also for this uh, tutorial I'm not going to use any audio so I'm going to delete the audio detach click and delete now this video doesn't have any audio at all now I want to bring my logo my TikTok uh, problem solver logo onto the second timeline I click on it adjust to make it smaller I think this is good I want to place it here so that it's not blocking the end part of the video. Okay, it's not blocking. That's good. Perfect. It's not uh, blocking the words, which I think is uh, useful. I want to make this logo rotate. So what I have to do is to click on this timeline, click on the keyframe, then move the playhead to the end. Okay, then come to the right side keyframe panel. Over here at the keyframe panel, I just double click to highlight the number and I will key in 360. Hit on enter and now you see the logo rotate. Okay, looks good to me. Now, after doing this, I want to block both the timeline. And uh, over here, you can see a uh, Singapore flag. I want to drag it down, make it the same length. Click on it, make it so small and place it inside my, hopefully to bring me more Singapore follow. I'll bring down this light bulb icon. The light but actually symbolize solution and I think uh, this is good I want to bring this I always like centralize it okay looks good let's uh, try okay looks good huh? also want to make the light bulb a bit stand out so I will use uh, choose an effect to make it uh, stand out a bit using okay I want to use this uh, red effect negative red just simply put it down okay and release the bulbs so you can see the light bulb actually changes color now we try I think this look good maybe I need to do some adjustment on the flag so now I lock this light bulb unlock the flag so that I can move it you can't move it when it's locked okay slightly to the left hmm. so in this case I would also have to move the light bulb slightly to the left and this looks good okay now I want to place the clock my live stream will usually start 9 30 p.m so i found a clock this is the clock saying 9 30. okay let's move it almost the same size reduce the size to almost the same as the logo almost the same will do now people can't really tell the difference and i think this is good so now the clock doesn't have any effect so it's not that clear I, how to make this clock a bit clearer is by using effect i think earlier on i used uh, negative red now i will choose maybe a uh, negative color okay drag it down to the image uh, timeline release haha <laughs> now you can see it's a bit more uh, clearer let's see how it goes okay with this effect i think people will take notice especially uh, at the end of the video uh, when the screen is a bit darker yeah you can actually see very clearly in my opinion this is clear okay i want to move down using the down arrow i can just move it down i think this is almost uh, the same the same height as the logo here Okay, let's play again. Play a bit faster. Okay, good. Now I want to lock this too, this two timeline, and I want to include some, add some text. So for this uh, tutorial, I'll choose quick text. Okay, or you can choose text the title from here. It's a different type of title, but I like to use uh, quick text because it's quick. <laughs> Since this is an uh, uh, announcement, I would like to add in something regarding the announcement. So I'll put it as live stream daily on TikTok at 9.30 p.m. solving your problems. I like to use this because this is 
this will look a bit uh, bigger and uh, clearer. So where do I want to put this? Uh, I don't want it to be blocking anything. So uh, maybe I just uh, reduce the size to 18. Move it to the center. Clock uh, slightly to the left. Okay, lock the clock again. Click on the text uh, timeline. I want to add some animation. I like to put it, uh, set it to loop and to add a bit bling bling. Aha, I think this looks good. Let's try. Hmm, not eye catching enough. Okay, so I want to change it a bit. Use the uh, left arrow key to fine tune. Okay, I think this looks good. Okay, we don't want this text to disturb. We don't want this text to disturb. So using the back key, you can adjust. So we shorten this. Uh -huh. Okay, I think this looks good. So we are ready to export. Click on export. Mm, nothing more to add. Yes, we have added everything. Click on export. Name the file. I name it uh, TikTok Start Announcement. So click on export. Open folder. I think this looks good. I think this looks good. Okay, we are done. Thank you very much.